I think what he's proposing uh, has more to do with his run for Congress than actually solving the problem. Governor Hobbs lashed out at Republican uh, House Speaker and congressional candidate Ben Toma, who just revealed what he called one of the toughest immigration laws ever written. That bill, one of dozens of GOP proposals moving through the legislature that bypasses the Democratic governor by sending them straight to the voters because they don't need Hobbs' approval. I think that we're seeing a lot of bills uh, that I vetoed last year go right to the ballot. Um, I think that is a strategy that will likely backfire. Toma's immigration law was not a casualty of the governor's veto stamp last year, but plenty of others were. Republicans are trying to send new proposals to the voters that would ban photo radar, affect the kinds of companies the state does business with, and make election changes. The number of ballot referrals threatens to confuse the voters. There's always concern about too many ballot referrals. That's, that's not new. That happens every year. Thomas said the number of referrals is up this year because of divided government between the GOP-led legislature and the Democratic executive while Hobbs explained why she vetoed a record number of bills in the first place. Arizonans uh, made it clear they want sanity over chaos, and a lot of these bills I vetoed because they're the exact opposite of that. Now, in response to the governor's comments, Speaker Toma said his bill was more about the inaction of the federal government, the Biden administration, and Governor Hobbs to fix the border crisis. Should be a reminder right now that Toma did send out a fundraising email within hours of revealing his immigration bill. Back over to you guys.